So today we're going to be making kebabs the Moroccan way. Scoop that up, thank you so much. They're juicy, tender, and delicious. Let's cut the ingredients and get started. Hey there, I'm Lorraine from Beyond the Savannah. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. If you've already subscribed, thank you so much. Lots of love to you. So today we're going to be making kebabs the Moroccan way. Now, kebabs can be served with a variety of dishes, whether it is naan, or a delicious mash, or served on a bed of tzatziki sauce. Let's gather ingredients and get started. So we have our low fat minced meat and then some regular minced meat. I like to have 50-50 just so as, you know, not to have so much fat in my minced meat. Then we've got chopped onions and then we have our spices. We've got salt, um, danajera, we've got Spanish paprika, we've got garam masala, black pepper and some cayenne powder. In your bowl, you want to mix your regular minced meat with your low fat minced meat. I mean, you don't have to, you know, have it 50 50, but that's to my own preference. Have your onions and literally we are eyeballing it. Mix it all up. The onions are going to help with retaining the moisture in your grilled kebab and so in goes our spices now if you want to add like fresh mint go ahead and do so um, if you've got like cumin feel free to add some more spices to your liking next you want to transfer it to a chopping board and just chop it go just chop it finely so if you don't do this process you can go ahead and add an egg to it but I prefer to do this to mine so you want to chill it in the fridge so our meat has been chilling for about 30 minutes in the fridge now let's roll them up into cylindrical shape first you want to water your hands this is going to prevent the meat from sticking so take a good chunk the next you want to go in with your skewers take two and just fold them like that And there you have it, your first kebab. So let's make another one. So next, we wanna pop these in into the air fryer. To cook these, for about 10 to 15 minutes at 200 degrees Celsius. So our kebab is done. Let's see how they look like. Yum. Let's plate our kebab. So let's make a tzatziki sauce. We have dill, Greek yogurt, English cucumber, um, black pepper, white vinegar, and salt. So thinly cut your dill done and then add them to your container next you want to grate your cucumber so, because cucumber retains a lot of water you want to squeeze all that water out to your bowl so next, you want to add a pinch of salt, a pinch or two of salt, like be generous with the salt. 
and then in goes your black pepper and then your white vinegar mix that and then in goes your Greek yogurt oh there you have it so there you have it our tzatziki sauce and this goes really well with a grilled kebab or naan check out my previous videos for the full recipe so we have our tzatziki sauce yeah. and then take your kebabs and they slide out so easily so there you have it our moroccan style kebab with tzatziki sauce as always let's do a taste test mm, scoop that tzatziki sauce mm. they're juicy tender and delicious try it out and let me know in the comments until next time happy cooking bye